Hey guys, welcome back to WP Event Manager. And in this video, we're gonna show you how to modify an organizer and how to reassign one organizer to an event. Okay, so this will be a two part video and we're gonna cover it up from the front end side. So to manage or modify your organizers, you have two ways, okay? So with WP Event Manager, we give you a like independent organizer dashboard page, okay? So that comes uh, pre-installed with WP Event Manager when we install the plugin and configure it via the automatic method. So this organizer dashboard page, it comes from one single shortcode, okay? I thought I might explain it a little bit. So this organizer dashboard shortcode you see over here in this page is responsible for all the uh, actions over here or the elements you see in this uh, page. Okay. So these are organizer name, their details, their event counts, action buttons as well. They all come from this uh, organizer dashboard shortcode. Okay. So this is organizer dashboard. From here you can perform like certain actions such as like duplicate the organizer, view their page, their uh, details, their event count and even their like edit button as well so if you click this edit button it will let you modify the organizer as well okay so what we're gonna do uh we're gonna go inside our event dashboard so with wp event managers new update we'll let you modify or manage your event organizers from the event dashboard itself so to access that page, you need to click on this organizer link over here and it will load up the organizer dashboard inside the event dashboard itself. One centralized way to manage your organizers. All right. So what we're going to do, we're going to modify one organizer over here. Okay. And we're going to modify uh, one event to add that organizer into that event as well. Okay. So what you're going to do, let's click on this pencil button to edit our organizer. So over here, you can edit every details about your organizer starting from name their logo their description their organizer email website like all the social links as well so everything you can modify okay so over here if i like had to like uh, type in a new description for our organizer uh, let's say another line uh, let's say organizes some awesome events in the town by so far okay so this is like really a like example but you can understand like you can edit all of the organizer details over here so when you are done editing the details you can click on save changes and it will take effect immediately okay so how do you reassign or let's say modify organizer for your events if you ask so let's go to our event dashboard okay and we're gonna like modify this tech job fair berlin uh, event and we're going to change the organizer from its existing organizer to our newly modified organizer okay so how you can do that it's pretty simple if you scroll down towards the bottom you will see the organizer section has like wp event manager as the organizer as of now so over here you can choose like all the other organizer as well right so how you can like modify this organizer field you can close this that will remove the current organizer you can choose whatever the new organizer you will like to assign to this event and click on save changes and that will modify the organizer for this event in an instant okay so if i click on this button and view this you'll see the organizer is now not wp event manager instead our new organizer with their updated description okay so that's how easy it is to modify your organizers from the front end side and modify one organizer inside your event as well okay so you don't have to assign uh, the modified organizer in here let's say if i want to like just change the organizer for this event you can do this uh, via this way as well so pretty much self-explanatory but pretty handy so let us know in the comment what you think of this video if you found it helpful leave a like leave a comment subscribe to the channel all that good stuff until next time i'm just saying goodbye thank you for watching and i'll catch you in the next one